Hey everybody, Jay here, and I got something a little different for you today. Uh, the video is not going to be that great because I'm doing this kind of off the cuff. Uh, I don't really have the greatest space to do this, but we are going to be doing a little Lego Harry Potter building. Uh, my girlfriend was amazing and got me my first Harry Potter Lego set. Uh, I've been looking at this quite a bit in the stores when I was doing some Christmas shopping and before I did some Christmas shopping. I kind of had my eye on this. Um, and lo and behold, uh, I unwrapped this bad boy. So let's get started and see what's inside the box. Put my Harry Potter magic wand pen away. Um, first thing, let's just take a look at this box right here. Pretty sweet. This is the clock tower. This is actually the scene um, of the, um, uh, the Yule Ball. Uh, during Goblet of Fire. So we've got the clock tower over here and a little Christmas tree and we've got some minifigures to look at as well. So um, yeah, that's the front and then the back here we see we've got some levels here in the clock tower and uh, we got some cool little animation things that uh, it'll be able to do after we got it done putting it together. I'm pretty excited to get this going. Um, this is one of my favorite areas of the castle, actually, the clock tower. Um, Prisoner of Azkaban is actually my favorite of the three, uh, book and movie. And, you know, I had dealt with a lot of time. So the clock tower was just like a pivotal piece, uh, mostly in the movie. Um, but I love that courtyard area uh, where the clock tower is as well. So um, anyway, let's uh, let's get into it. Uh, oh, actually, before that, let's... Uh, we can take a look here really quick at the minifigures that are inside the box. And uh, I'll have pictures later, little close-ups. I might do a little, little video of the little minifigure guys, but uh, let's open her up and see what we got inside. Could have got a knife and done this, but they took my knife at the airport, sadly. All right. We have her opened up. And we've got some bags here with uh, numbers. I have not put Legos together in many a moon, so this is going to be pretty interesting for me. Number six, number one. We've got some instructions and some stickers. A pretty thick manual. Holy crap! That's a th that's a pretty thick manual for freaking Lego. But we're gonna need it. Bag three, bag five, bag four. Oh, that's not too much. Not too bad. And a couple little stands here. I think that's, yeah, that's everything. All right. Set this aside here. Okay. I'm sure it was a way for me to like put it on the wall so you guys can see what I'm doing. All right. So we got bags of stuff. We've got our instruction manual here. I actually have the Santa Claus on TV right now. I am not through with Christmas yet. I refuse to let it go, especially when we had no snow. Like the past, past like five, seven years we have not had snow here in Michigan for Christmas and it's so, so sad. So sad. Got some stickers and a little uh, stained glass window sticker here of a uh, mermaid, which is pretty cool. Not too many stickers. Put those over there. All right. Um, so we've got bags. We've got a book, instructions. So uh, this will probably cut to uh, a time lapse. Uh, I might stop here or there to talk a little bit uh, about some things. But other than that, Let's uh let's get going. 